Okay, good day to the historic Wolfram Entertainment District. This is a personalised video message for HWED. Um, look, it's it's Aussie Man from Aussie Man Reviews. Here's my face. You you know me. You know me. Historic Wolfram Entertainment District. Destination fact. Destination fact. What a wanker bastard motherfucking dickhead. <laughs> That's me impersonating myself. Oi, uh, HWED, look, I've been contacted um, by someone you know, I guess. Um, they invited me to the entertainment district and um, I managed to go along. It was quite, quite interesting. I managed to get out and go to Pittsburgh's north side and I visited Paul's uh, house, the Annex. I visited that, that fucking drinking club and then I went on to Club Phil. Um, the garage nightclub and um, and yeah, look, I, I I just I felt compelled to leave a review after I got invited to this entertainment district and um, look, the annex wasn't bad. Paul's fucking house there that that wasn't bad for for a drink. Um, I mean, the toilet was clogged and it had a weird kind of mouldy smell overall throughout the whole the whole house pub. Um, so I'm not sure there needs to be some better cleaning that goes on at the annex because it, I, you know, I don't want to whinge too much and complain because I can just fucking sit there and have a drink in any kind of condition. But, um, it's just something that was a bit off putting, you know, you go to flush the toilet and it's just nothing's happening. And then that like the smell is just really musty and it's, yeah. It, anyway, I, I moved on from, from there, from the annex. And um, went round the corner to um, Club Phil. And Club Phil was good at first. I was like, oh, fuck yes, this has a good atmosphere. This isn't as depressing and morose and sullen as Paul's fucking annex house. This is, this is, this is upbeat. This is exciting. I was like, yeah, all right. Fucking Club Phil. Here we go. Let's go Pittsburgh. And, um, and then it went downhill. Then things got really nasty. Um, first of all, there wasn't a toilet at all. I mean, I had to go back to the annex and use that clogged toilet. And, and that's a real bummer because sometimes, you know, you misjudge things. You go out for a big night and you realise you need to do a shit like halfway through the night. And it's like, fuck, I fucked this up. That kebab I had was too big. Now I've got to do a shit halfway through the night. And there's just no toilet option in the garage. So what do you do? you got to go back to the annex and use that clogged toilet. So that was awkward. <clears throat> yeah, that was, not, that was not a good experience. And then I discovered that the staff in the garage uh, nightclub were underpaid. And that just felt awkward. I'm like, oh, ethically, do I want to support bloody Club Phil? I know all the profit is going to the boss and these drink staff, they're getting no fucking money. So... Yeah, that just didn't feel right on a moral level. I'm like, ah, oh, I don't like this place now. And um, yeah, so the toilet, the, the staff being underpaid and, uh, and, and what else? Yeah, the smell at the annex wasn't good. So I didn't really want to go, go back there. Oh yeah, the food at the garage, the finger food and the snacks and everything. <laughs> oh, that was rough the next day. That was rough. I don't think it was the alcohol that fucked me over. I think it was the food. Talk about food poisoning. Yeah, so overall, yeah, pretty pretty dodgy experience in the historic Wolfram Entertainment District. But uh, maybe one day, like as time goes on, I'll look back on it all very fondly. I'll be like, look, that was tough at the time, but those were good days. Those were good days, the more I think about it. So maybe. Maybe it'll, it will age well, uh, my memories. In the meantime, wouldn't go back there. Avoid, avoid that district altogether. Anyway, uh, <laughs> oh, fuck. Thank you for watching Aussie Man Reviews, uh, guys. I really appreciate it. Clearly, I, I need some more water down here. I'm coughing like a motherfucker. I've got to make another coffee. But yeah, thank you. And, and all the best with your entertainment district. Honestly, it sounds wonderful. If I actually do make it there one day, I'm sure I will have a fucking great time. So yeah, now nah, thank you again for watching Aussie Man. And I'm going to go. I'm rambling. I've got verbal diarrhea. It's, it's an issue. It is a problem. It's a problem.